A handrail is not usually thought of as a tool, but it is, and baby humans come to depend on them just as adults do. At Karen Adolph's lab, researchers ran a number of experiments using a handrail. The first thing they wanted to know was whether a 16-month-old toddler knows when they need the support of a handrail. As the bridge gets narrower, Stephanie becomes more cautious. And when it's too narrow, she pats the ground with her foot. And then looks to the researcher for help. Then a full railing is put in place. Stephanie taps the handrail and makes sure it's solid. Grasping the rail, she decides to trust it. Then researchers replaced the wooden handrail with a soft rubber one. They wanted to find out whether the use of the handrail is a deep understanding on the part of the child. In other words, do they understand that what the handrail is made of will support their weight, or is it simply something they automatically grab hold of? She knows something is amiss. She swings it once or twice, and then turns back. That's what wise babies do at this age. When one researcher tries to entice her with food and toys, Stephanie tries to explain her dilemma to the other one. She does everything to the rail. She tastes it, she feels it, but she knows it's completely untrustworthy. Then she appeals to the researcher. She knows that an adult can also be used as a tool in a pinch. Yeah. 